All right, people, here we go. The second semifinal matchup. Yeah, man, it's finally here. I know you guys have been waiting. Let's scroll down right here before we get started. It's Prioxis, the number one ranked fighter in this tournament, and he's going up against Big Daddy Suspensa. And don't forget, the winner of this best two out of three falls goes up against Peyton, who's been waiting in the wings for awfully too long. Here we go, baby. Welcome, welcome. We have finally made it to the second semifinal matchup. Man, these guys have finally got their schedules in line and they're ready to strap on those virtual UFC gloves. And here we go, best two to three falls. And if you're tuning in for the first time, my name is Ricky J. And this is my random fighter select tournament where guys randomly select they use the random button to select their fighter in a best two to three falls so here we go prioxis one of the most decorated if not i would have to say he is the most decorated xbox fighter and one of the top ea sports ufc fighters in general man rocking some signs here and then suspensa using uri faber and suspensa is no joke so let's see what happens man the one thing I really like about Prioxis is his ability to be patient and to be defensive and using that defensive ability to start his offense. So let's see what he does. He, he's not one to, you know, blow right through you in the first couple of minutes. I've said that before. He really is a guy that likes to bust saw through people. So let's see what happens. Let's see what Suspensa has, man. Suspensa, out of all people in this tournament, has had quite the circus show. Uh, of an experience in this tournament and he's still standing he's still here and let's see what he's got here against Mr. Prioxis now Frankie signs I don't know his stats though in this game but you got to give the edge statistically to Uriah Faber though wouldn't you oh look at this look at this great start for Suspensa here Nice. And he's got Prioxis whiffing a little bit. And Prioxis throughout this tournament, man, he's been tested. So it's not like he's been just bulldozing through people. He's been tested. He's been through some tough battles. So he knows what's up, man, when he gets rocked early in a fight. And let's see if Suspensa can maintain that composure. You don't want to go all crazy and start uh, going nuts for the finish. It always reminds me of when I used to play UFC 2. Remember that number one ranked guy? I don't see him around. Let me know if you see him around. His name was like uh, ONL1 Chica or whatever his name was. But uh, there's some videos where I... Oh, look at this. Some pushback. There's some videos where I rocked him and then I tried to go for the finish right away. And then I got KO'd. So... <laughs> You always got to be careful against these elite fighters. But look at Prioxis. Evening. Evening. That's hard to say. Evening up the rock meter, man. The rock standings here. It's 1-1 as far as rocks. And you may have to give the slight edge to Prioxis in this round, man. I love how he does that. <laughs> he fakes like he's going to go tie your shoe. <laughs> he fakes the takedown. Did you guys see that? The, um, you know, you can abort pretty much anything in this game that you do. Anything offensive. So if you try to go for a takedown, you could abort it by pushing R2 or RT for you Xbox guys. Can you fake a clinch? I don't know if a lot of people do that where they fake the old clinch action. Can you fake a clinch and go for a takedown? Let me know in the comments. But here we go. Round two. And look at how Prioxis people is starting to... <laughs> he's driving a standard car. He's putting, the ge he's putting the car into third gear, man. He started off in first and second, and now it seems like he's ramping it up a little bit. And Suspensa can't be whiffing at air, man. He's got to just keep, keep his composure. There he goes. Both guys aren't, you know, unloading the tank. 
And look at how Prioxus wants to go for a slow dance, man. He wants to clinch. He's planting all the seeds, isn't he? <laughs> Prioxus, the gardener, he's planting the seeds of striking, the seeds of takedowns, the seeds of clinching. And that's what makes him one of the best, is that ability to just always keep you guessing. And now he's wrestling. Oh, he's going for the old chicken leg or the chicken arm. <laughs> Chicken arm, man. Every time I say that to all the KFC fans out there, baby, I need to get my KFC fix. I'm telling you right now, if I order the KFC action, I'm going to put it on Twitter and on Instagram. But here we go, man. It looks like we have a finish here, man. It's over. Just like that, Prioxis. And the way he set that all up was fantastic. Faking takedowns, faking clinches, then going for takedowns. Getting a couple of denials and then getting a great submission right there. And nothing's better than getting a submission, but it's even better when you do it in a tournament matchup that's going to be broadcasted on good old YouTube. But what a great fight. What a great fight. Suspensa needs to regroup here. I don't know, man. I think Suspensa did a good job in the, in the beginning there, but I felt like he was a little too gun-shy. I think he's got to let his hands go a little bit. We're going to keep it here. I think he needs to let his hands go. He's got to just take some chances. And here we go. Are we in lightweight? Let's see. Oh, Anthony Pettis. You know Prox is going to keep Anthony Pettis. Come on. Anthony Pettis was my favorite guy to use in UFC 2. Gilbert Burns. He's got to roll it. Oh, he rolls it again and gets a respectable Michael Johnson. And this is going to be a fantastic fight in my opinion. Um, you know, Michael Johnson, I like to call him Steady Eddie. Like, he's not great in everything. He's just good in everything. And he has a very basic move set. But, you know, he's a decent pick. And Pettis is good as well. So this is going to be quite the matchup. You know, Suspense has got to watch out for those kicks of Pettis, though. <laughs> Pettis always has that cartwheel kick. I was, like, in love with the cartwheel kick when this game first came out. You guys remember that? I would always use... Who did I always use? Zabit all the time, for sure. I use Pettis. Ferguson, I think, has it. And even, does it, doesn't Holloway have it as well? But, um, yeah, I've kind of um, shied away from it just because if you miss and you get hit, it counts as a knockdown. You know what I mean? So you got to be careful with that. But look at this. Phone booth action. Let's see, man. I really want to see Suspensa let the hands go, man. Let those hands flow. And with Johnson, he Johnson's kind of like a poor man's Nick Diaz. You know what I mean, isn't he? <laughs> He's able to throw with volume. Nice. I wouldn't mind seeing Suspensa do a nice, a nice uh, duck quick duck go for an uppercut I love doing that you're not seeing a lot of uppercuts from Prioxis but you could sneak it in you know one time if you do it twice you know he's too good to pick up on that but just to do a little duck to get under that hook or that straight or that jab and then go for that rear uppercut you may get a rock and I don't think Pettis has the greatest head health oh I hate that kick <laughs> let me know if you're one of the guys that just Hates that spinning sidekick, spinning jumping sidekick to the body. I feel like it does so much damage. And when you're facing Adesanya, oh, it's annoying. But yeah, suspense, man. Let things flow, brother. It's easier said than done. There he goes. Getting some touching action. Paroxys just does such a good job of. You know, throwing you off with his unpredictability, man. Like I said. And he's patient. You know, S Suspensa is trying, man. He really is. He's trying to get in there. Parox is doing a fantastic job. Blocking. Keeping that octagon control. See, if I'm suspense, I see that moment right there where nobody was striking. Got to go for something, man. 
And I'm only saying that because we're seeing the same thing being played out here in this second fight. He's got to give Pryoxus a new look. And he's showing really good technical striking, but I just think, you know, in order to break the will, I don't know if you can break the will of Pryoxus, but to break his game plan, kind of throw him off to get that curveball in there. He's got to showcase a different element of offense here. Let's see if he does. Very technical, isn't it? Nice. There he goes. There he goes. <laughs> Come on, pull the Nick Diaz, man. Nick or Nate. Yeah, man, Ricky. That's what's up, man. I haven't been on this channel for a while. Yo, <laughs> that's it. <laughs> I, almost, I almost let my mic fall out of my hands there. Hopefully you didn't hear a big thump, but there we go. Suspensa. Strike and blood here. Is it striking blood or drawing blood? But here we go. And there he goes. There he goes. That's what we want, man. That's what we want. Go get it. And that passive style usually works against most guys, but it wasn't working. And now he's just channeling his inner Nick, but oh, great head movement. Just when you thought Suspensa was gaining ground, Pryoxis goes with a nice counter right there. Wow. And we and we haven't seen a lot of slips by Pryoxis, but he times it at the right time right there. But I like I love how Suspensa is going out on his shield right here. He knows he's been rocked, but he's throwing. You know, the only way you're gonna win is if you throw, man. And he's not giving up. Respect to both guys. Holy, I'm on the edge of my seat right here. Just because you're seeing su Suspensa, you know, put it in a different gear here. He knows it's now or never, really. It is. His tournament life is on the line getting this far. Is he going to be able to punch his ticket in an unforgettable matchup with Peyton? Or is it going to be Pryoxis doing what the odds maker said, getting himself to the finals? Nice head movement. Oh, he had that kick to the body right there. Oh, but he wanted, he's like Ricky, I didn't want to get the kick to the body. I wanted some flying knee action. If I'm in Suspense's corner, though, no more kicks to the body, man. Your head is too scrambled. No more of that. Because it leaves your head wide open. You don't want any of that, brother. There you go. Nice. Oh. Watch out. <laughs> Suspense is in zombie mode. He's exhausted. And when I get into that mode, you know, you know, when my my fighter is exhausted, I just go with strong strikes, you know, like one hook, one uppercut, you know, rear uppercuts, straight uppercut, you know, jab uppercut, or just rear uppercut. I always go for just quick and strong strikes. You know what I mean? Do you guys do that as well when you're exhausted? Just quick strikes. No, I don't mean by quick strikes, strong strikes, but only one or two. Hopefully I made sense with all that. It's hard to talk and watch this fight, and it looks like this is over. It's over. Mr. Pryoxis, the big man, the guy that loves wearing hoods, <laughs> is going to the finals, man. What a great performance. What a beautiful job that he did putting that knowledge, the skill, all together in one package and... Putting together two fantastic victories right there. But respect to Suspensa for making it this far, man. What a great showing that you did in this tournament. But um, it's okay, man. It's okay to lose to Pryoxys. But we got the Big P going up against Big P. It's P versus P crime. Peyton versus Pryoxys. Hoping we can get that fight in before the week ends for sure. Can't wait for that. But uh, let me know your thoughts on this fight. And I'll catch you in the next one, guys. Happy Easter. Have a good one. 
and I'll catch you in the next one. This is Ricky J Baby from Ricky J Sports, and you are awesome.